if we are talking about sell and purchase, what your mind try to thinking? Mm, the price. Yes, price. about price. Right, next, about what? How many? How many? Okay, how many? How much about the product? All right, next, about what? Sell and purchase. Mm, quality. Quality, of course. Quality about discount, is it? About size, about color, about location, about a review. All right, be be uh, before I uh, want to buy something in Lazada or Shopee, okay? So I must see the review first. All right, uh, okay. So let's go. We are going to the first slide for today. So first place, we're going to the market, okay? Because we want to buy a barang keperluan harian di pasar. Uh, we want to buy a barang keperluan harian di pasar. That means it's daily need in market. So I bring you going to the uh, market. So you will be found the wet item. Okay, the wet item. Uh, this is the wet item that you cook every day, that you eat every day maybe. Okay, uh, so uh, let me introduce you now. Uh, let no, not yourself. Let me introduce to you how about thing in Bahasa Melayu. Okay, of course you know what a thing in your language. But today you have to know the thing in Bahasa Melayu because you must answering the thing in exam. Okay, let's I introduce you the first this uh what we call it this please read in Bahasa Melayu. What it is? Udang. Yes. Udang, okay. Udang in English is shrimp. Uh, huh? Huh? Yes, shrimp. Okay, shrimp. Some of you maybe maybe say brown. Is it? Ah, uh, okay. So this is udang. I know you know this one, but you have to know in Bahasa Melayu. Okay. So the second one is meat. Okay, meat only. If you don't know, this is a beef or lamb. Okay. If you need, uh, this is a cow for cow, of course. We call it is beef. Okay. If you don't know, you just say meat only. Okay. But in Bahasa Melayu, okay, beef. Beef, we call it is. This it is. What it is? Hmm? Please, someone try to read it. What it is? Daging lembu. Yes. Daging lembu. Okay. Daging lembu. Good pronunciation. Daging lembu. So the third one, this is a fish. Okay, fish. Fish in Bahasa Melayu, we call it what? Ikan. ikan. Yes, ikan. Okay, you have to know. Ikan, ikan what? Because ikan also have the name. So we just put ikan only. Okay. Uh, all ikan. right. So the third one. The third one look like alien. My kid says, "Mummy, this is aliens." <laughs> All right, uh, looks like alien. So what it is in Bahasa Melayu? Ketam. Ketam. Ah uh, yes, ketam. Okay. Almost student uh, always to pronounce ketam, not ketam. Ke. Ketam. All right. Ah, uh, this is a ketam, not ketam. All right. Crab. And that one, we call it in Bahasa Melayu, what it is? Sotong. Again? Sotong. Sotong. Okay, Sotong. Ah. Sotong. What Sotong? What Sotong? Huh? What is in English? What Sotong in English? Hmm? Uh, it's a squid. Squid. Uh, yes. Okay. Squid. Some of you maybe say calamari, uh, cuttlefish, uh, octopus, kurita, whatever lah. Okay. But in Bahasa Melayu, we just call it sotong. Okay. Uh, we just call it sotong. Okay. So the last one, uh, this is a chicken. The favorite of almost people in the world. Right? Chicken. Uh, so what chicken in Bahasa Melayu? Ayam. Yeah. Ayam. 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 Okay. So you have to know the word item in Bahasa Melayu. Okay. Alright. So we are going to the second part. 
The second part is vegetable and uh, fruit. Okay, we have a fruit and vegetable. Vegetable. So I just put a few of uh fruit only. Okay, because after this you have an activity with your partner. Okay, you have an activity. You have know what your favorite food. You have know about the price and you have know about the uh taste. Okay. Ah, uh, if your favorite food is not here, okay, please find the name in Bahasa Melayu. All right. So this is we call it durian. Durian. Okay. Ah, uh, how about this? Who already tried durian? Hmm. I I have tried. Yes, Ismail. Yeah. How about this durian? Uh, I think it's very delicious and uh, very uh, the, delicious. <laughs> the smell is some. Yes, ah, so smelly. If you come to Malaysia, you cannot bring durian go to hotel, right? Cannot <laughs> because so smelly. So smell is very strong. Okay, the whole building can uh smell the durian. Ah, and then durian is so expensive in Malaysia. I don't know. I am not sure in China how many. Because in Malaysia is so expensive, and durian have a season, not have every time have not have a season, okay. And durian in Malaysia we call it as a king of fruit, ah, king of fruit, alright, raja buah, okay. So if if you didn't try, you come to Malaysia, you have to try. How about this? Some of you maybe don't like durian, alright. So the third one, what we call it is, in Bahasa Melayu, nanas. Nanas. Okay. Nanas. Nanas. Okay. Some like uh, Arabic. Arabic maybe say ananas. Maybe ananas. Who uh, Arabic language here? Please confirm me. Is it ananas in Arabic? Yes, it's called ananas. Ah, okay, ananas. Okay. How about taste ananas? How about this? Sour and, sour and sweet. Sweet. Okay. Please tell me. Uh, so sweet in Bahasa Melayu. Uh, the topic the topic four. Uh, please recap. So sweet in Bahasa Melayu. Uh, what we call it? Uh, uh, what? Please, someone, are you forget to all of things? Money. Huh? Yes, again? Manis. Yes, manis. manis. Ah, sangat manis. Okay, very sangat. sweet, sangat manis. Okay? Alright, how about sangat masam? Sangat masam, what meaning masam? Sour. Yes, sour. Okay? Sometimes I found I find uh I found ananas is sour. Sometimes ananas is uh sweet. Okay, based on the based on the jenis lah. Kadang bakar dia manis, kadang masam. Alright, so this one is uh apa? What we call it? Shang tua, shang shang tiao. In China, what we call it? China shang tua, shang tiao. Yes. 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 Shang tiao. Ah, shang. shang Shang Tiao, okay? Shang Tiao. Same in Bahasa Melayu, Pisang. Pisang, okay? Uh, Shang Tiao in Bahasa Melayu is Pisang. Okay, how about this Pisang? Pisang, how about this? Hmm? Manis. 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 Manis, very good, manis. Is it delicious or not? Of course. Yeah. <laughs> Yes. yes, of course. Okay. So, the next part is manga. Manga in Bahasa Melayu, mango in Bahasa Inggris. Okay. Manga, how about this? Uh, manis or masam? Sweet or sour? Which one? Manis. Manis, yes. Maybe it's orange color, it's so sweet. It's green color, so uh, sour maybe. Right, uh, maybe. All right. So, uh, this one is tembika. You have no the num the numbers, no number the name in the name of fruit. Tembika. Okay, try to pronounce it. Tembika. 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 Mm -hmm. Yes, very good. 
easy to pronounce, right? So this one is rambutan. Rambutan. So I put to pronounce it rambutan. 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 Uh, yeah. so China student, please, okay, please practice your capital capital letter R. Rambutan. Ah, uh, because always lambutan, lambutan, rambutan. Okay, sometimes, sometimes rambutan looks like a lychee. Okay, but the rambutan have a hair at outside. That's why we call it rambutan. Do you remember in topic three? Maybe I uh, teach you about. Rambut dia sangat lurus. Rambut dia sangat kerinting. Okay. That means it's straight hair or curly hair. Okay. Rambut. Is it rambut? Ah, so ni rambut. Okay. That's why we call it is rambutan. Because uh, this would have a hair in the outside. Right. Rambutan. Okay. So the last one is papaya. What papaya in Bahasa Melayu? Hmm? Someone? Bertik. 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 Yes. Bertik. Okay. Ah, bertik. Okay. If you say petik, petik that means. Ah, okay. It's not, it's not petik. Petik that means. It's, ah, itu petik. Kalau bertik that means is papaya. Okay. Ah, petik is papaya. Okay. Going to the next part. Is it so fast? Sorry. If you think it's so no, fast. No, 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 it's okay. It's okay. No, it's okay. It's okay, teacher. All right. So if I'm going to so fast, please tell me, all right? Because we have the one hour for only for today. For only for today only. All right. This is a vegetable, all right? Vegetable. This is a co-base. Co-base in Bahasa Melayu. Cabbage in Bahasa Inggris, right? So I'm not sure. In uh, China, what we call China? Co-base in Bahasa uh, in China? That's it. Yuan Chai. Yuan Chai? Ah? Ah? Uh, slow, slow. I want to follow it. Pao Chai. Ah? Ah, ah, lah. I don't know lah. <laughs> Alright. But I'm trying, I'm trying for the answer, okay? In Arabic, what we call it in Arabic? Kobes? Mustafa? Lahana. Ah, Yahana? Lahana. Lah. Lahana. Alright, Lahana. Uh, easy to mm. easy to pronounce based on the China. <laughs> <laughs> okay, don't worry. I, I have to learn the name in China because after that I'm going to the China. Alright, this one, Terong. Okay, Terong. Mm. In Bahasa Melayu. In Bahasa English, mm. maybe some of you call Bringer. Maybe some of you call um, Eggplant. Yeah. Okay. Ah, the color is purple. Sometimes it's green color. Okay, the next one is loba merah. Actually, merah is a red loba color. Okay. Merah. Ah, merah is a red color, but oh, this is a uh, orange color. So we don't call loba or loba orange. No, we call loba merah. I don't know why. Please don't ask me. Okay. Okay, this one is kobes. Kobes. And the kobes, bunga kobes. This one kobes, the one bunga kobes. Okay. We, uh, in English, we call it is colic flower. Okay. Colic flower. So that one is, I know it, uh, this is a very uh, famous bunga. every country. So what it is? Sawi. Apa dia? Sawi. Yes, sawi. Okay, what it is in Bahasa Inggeris? Ah, what it is in Bahasa Inggeris? Okay, I, I told you lah because it's so late <laughs> waiting for you. Um, mustard. Okay, this is a mustard. Ah, so you have to know mustard. this is a mustard. And that one is kangkung. Okay, kangkung. Okay, kangkung. Uh, we call it is uh in English is a uh, water spinner. Ah, water spina. This is my favorite vegetable, water spina. Okay. And that one is tomato. Some of you may be claim for me. Teacher, tomato is a fruit. Uh, it's a fruit group, not vegetable. But in Malaysia, tomato is a vegetable group, not a fruit. Okay. 
uh, tomato in bahasa Melayu, tomato in bahasa Inggeris. So now, uh, you have a want activity. Okay, you have a want activity uh, because we don't have any, uh, any time. So uh, we do it activity together. Okay, actually, I give you a 10 minute to communicate uh, uh, to your friend. Okay, to asking your friend how about uh, the question like this. Apakah buah kegemaran kamu? What's your favorite fruit? Okay. Okay. And then, how about taste? Bagaimanakah rasanya? And then, how about price? Berapakah harganya? Okay. But today, I want asking to you, so, 10, 10 student lucky for today. Okay. I would like to call your name. Okay. So, now, please find your favorite fruit. If your favorite food is not uh, there, if not uh, here, please find your favorite food. Like a strawberry maybe, like a grape, like an apple. I don't know your favorite food. Okay, I would like to call your name. Okay, the first name, of course, Mustafa. Mustafa, yeah, okay. <laughs> because I already yes. give you the template. Uh, I already give you the template, question and answer. So you have to answer me based on this template, right? So easy. Okay. Okay, Mustafa. Apakah yeah, yeah. buah kegemaran kamu? Buah kegemaran saya uh, Ayla, nanas, nanas. Jiman. Okay, danas dan mangga, not di dan. dan. Okay. Ah, uh, dan dan. Sorry, yes. sorry. Nanas dan mangga. Bagaimanakah yeah. rasanya? Uh, ra rasanya. Uh, mm -hmm. uh, Okay, sorry, sorry, sorry. And, uh, min, minas. Huh? Minas? Manis. Yeah. Manis, manis, manis. Sorry, ah, sorry. Okay, rasanya manis. Berapakah rasanya... harganya? Uh, sorry, uh, actually I didn't get this one because I, I didn't know what does mean this one. Okay, this one is how much? Okay. Ah, sorry, sorry, sorry. Ah, how much? Uh, uh, Hargian, Eli, uh, Eli, uh, Lima. Lima, Lima what? Lima kilos. Okay, Lima what? Lima tahun? No, no, kilos. Yes, kilo. Okay, yes, kilo. I know kilo, but you have put yeah. Lima what? Lima ringgit per kilo. Uh, ah, lima ringgit. Uh, nah, lima sekilo. Lima sekilo. Okay. Nah. Harga, that means it's price. Okay, you have put ringgit. Okay. Harganya ah. lima ringgit sekilo. Okay. Harganya ah. lima ringgit sekilo. You have put the price. Ah. Nah, say lima okay. only. If you say ah, lima, ah, okay, okay. that means it's lima what? Lima pieces? Lima, ah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah Alright. Thank you, Mustafa. Thank you. you get it. Yeah, All right, so Ismail. Yes, teacher. Okay, Ismail, tell me, apakah buah kegemaran kamu? Uh, buah kalam, buah kegemaran saya ilaha uh, ila um, pisang. Pisang. Okay. Ap bagaimanakah rasanya? Uh, rasanya. Um, Masaya hmm? batik. Hmm? Rasanya apa? Mm, batik. Betik? <laughs> apa betik rasanya? How about taste pisang? Ah, ras, tas, uh, it's mm, mina. Uh, ra, uh, rasanya mina. Mina manis. Manis, manis. Ah, <laughs> rasanya manis. Okay. Yeah. Berapakah harganya? Uh, harganya... Ila Linki Linki Sambilan Sekilo. Not ringgit. You have put Sambilan ringgit. Uh, sambilan the, ringgit. Uh, the number first. Okay. Sambilan ringgit yeah. Sekilo. Wow. You're so expensive. <laughs> sambilan ringgit. Eh? <laughs> okay. Thank you, Ismail. The second one. Uh, Kong Yingxia. Kong, are you here, Kong Yinsha? Yes. 
I'm here, teacher. Okay, let's start. Apakah buah kegemaran kamu? Uh, buah kegemaran saya ialah uh, mangga. Mangga. Bagaimanakah rasanya? Ya. Yeah. Uh, rasanya manis. Rasanya manis. Bagus. Berapakah harganya? Um, harganya ialah enam ringgit sekilo. Okay, enam ringgit sekilo. Maybe. Okay. <laughs> okay, just go ahead. <laughs> Don't worry. Okay, thank you, Kong Yinsha. So, the third one is Almadi Mary. Almadi Mary. Are you here, Almadi? Almadi? Lisa, are you here, Lisa? Lisa? Sorry, teacher, Lisa is a driving test. Oh, driving. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, yeah, yeah. All right. So who's speaking now? Who's speaking? Oh, uh, it's me, it's me. <laughs> me, what's your name? Me. Yeah, I can see, I can see your, your name. Please tell me. Who me? Who's speaking? Uh, okay. Oh, uh, it's me. Sorry. Yes, I know it's me. Okay, who's speaking? Swin Rining? Is it you? Yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Reading. Okay, you have replaced for his part. Okay, Swin Reading. Apakah buah yeah. kegemaran kamu? Uh, buah kegemaran mara saya ialah uh, nanas. Okay, very good. Bagaimanakah rasanya? Uh, rasanya. Rasanya? Ya, rasanya. I forget how, how about the pronunciation for sweet. Ah. Okay, uh, yeah. sweet. Sweet, what? Please ask your friend. What sweet? In Bahasa Melayu? Manis. Manis. Sweet Rini, uh, manis. Okay? Ya, yeah, manis. Ber okay. Berapakah harganya? Um... Harga ia ialah dua puluh dua dua puluh ya ya sorry dua 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 sebiji dua sebiji okay dua ringgit you have put a ringgit okay dua ringgit sebiji okay yeah so thank you Sureni okay we are going to the next slide. Okay, because it's so rush. Okay. I give you the situation. Okay, do you remember the last week? I mean, it's the uh, the last week before you're standing a uh, test one. Okay. I told you, uh, you have a assignment two. Okay. You can get the situation. Uh, the, situa um, the assignment two is about a role play. Uh, do you remember I told you? The assignment two is about role play. Since topic four, I told you, you can use the dialogue I had given to you. And this the dialogue, okay, in this dialogue, uh, you can also be used to choose in your situation. Okay, if not topic four only, you can use the situation from topic five to make it your assignment number two. So, please don't make your own script, okay. If you make your own script and then you're using the Google Translate, okay, the situation is look like not naturally because your script look like a translation okay please use the script i provide in front of you in topic four i had given to you a three situation okay three situation in cafeteria and uh, how to order how to pay in the bill okay so today in topic five i prefer to you a three situation so you can choose which one situation you want Come from topic four or topic five to make it your role play uh, as assignment number two. So don't worry, assignment two, I will give it to you uh, week nine. Uh, next week, we don't have a class, all right? Next week, we don't have a class because you uh, have a midterm break for one week, okay? For sure, I'm missing you, okay? I so miss you for one week next week. 
And then after you come back, I will give it to you the assignment number two. All right. So, so uh, you you mean you mean next Monday? Next Monday. Uh, uh Monday and next Monday. The date is uh, I'm I don't have calendar. Uh, for sure, the like uh, next I, Monday. I mean after three okay, days. Okay. Yes, seven 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 December is Monday, right? Seven December is Monday. Okay, yes. please check. Okay. Yes. Seven until eleven. Uh, December, you have a midterm break. So this is a for holiday. all the subjects. Yes, to all of subject, to all of students, to all of everything. Uh, okay. 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 Uh, this is a Thank holiday you. time to you. This is uh. Nice news, <laughs> but I'm I will miss you. <laughs> yes. Ah. Uh, okay. This is a holiday time. Uh, okay. okay. And then after you come back, uh, 11, 12, 13, 14, 14 December, I give you assignment mm. number two. So before uh, so we right. have to we have to be ready on fourteen to to yes, to yes. present assignment two. No 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 no. Fourteen December I give you assignment number two. Okay. Uh huh. Okay. Ah, and then don't forget to submit your assignment number one. Ah, okay. Clear, Mustafa. Uh, assignment number one. You have to uh, submit. Well, yeah. Okay. Sorry. So uh. So we are going to the next slide. All right. So I hope everyone clear about that. So the situation is Salma who wants to buy a white item in market. Okay. Salma who wants to buy a wet item in market. And then, okay, everyone, please catch my pronunciation because we are so rushing for today. So let me read first and then you have to practice behind your mic. Okay. Let me mute to all of you first. Okay, listen carefully and try to practice it. Okay, Salma and Seller. Salma say, Selamat pagi. Berapakah harga sekilo ayam hari ini? Penjual, Seller. Selamat pagi, Puan. Harga sekilo ayam RM8.90 hari ini. Puan mahu berapa ekor? Salma say, kalau begitu, beri saya dua ekor, ya. Okay. Kalau begitu, beri saya dua ekor, ya. And then seller reply, biar saya timbang dahulu. Semuanya tiga kilo, puan. Okay. Baiklah, berikan saya, berikan saya. Sekilo udang dan sekilo daging juga ya. Berapakah harganya? Berapakah? Not berapakah. Ha. Okay. Because don't A in the end of the word. Berapakah harganya? And then seller say. Harga sekilo udang RM34. Please memorize the number. Uh, please memorize the number because after this, I would like to ask you the number because at the end of the slide, you have uh, so many figures. You have to read it. So please remember the number and how to read the number in ringgit. 34 ringgit. Dan harga sekilo daging 30 ringgit. Jumlah semuanya ialah 90 ringgit. 70 sen sahaja. Ini duitnya 91 ringgit. Ini bakinya 30 sen. Terima kasih Puan. Sama-sama. Okay. So sorry. Uh, because we uh, I didn't call. You try to read this. You have to practice with your own. So, let me try to translate this. Okay, Salma say, what happened in this situation? Salma say, good morning. Okay, good morning. Berapakah harga ayam sekilo hari ini? Okay, what is the price one kilo a chicken for today? Okay, what the price, what a price for a kilo chicken for today? And then seller say, good morning, madam. Okay, selamat pagi, puan. Okay, a uh, price a price for a kilo chicken today is eight ringgit ninety cent for today. Okay, why um 
he asking for today because the wet item in market every day is the price is different okay you have to asking the seller how many how much okay this is a different all right puan mahu berapa ekor how many do you want okay how many do uh, how many chicken do you want kalau begitu beri saya dua ekor ya yeah? please give me a two of chicken okay um ekor okay that uh, that uh, part i highlight ekor ekor that means is uh, you have to use it if you want to buy an animal animal only not vegetable not uh, fruit okay because in bahasa melayu we don't have singular or plural that means it's one or many okay so in bahasa melayu we have to put how many you want three two five four uh, how many okay this is a complement ekor complement the item for animal so you should to be put ekor okay okay i give an example uh mustafa okay mustafa because your name is easy to yes. remember okay yeah, yeah, yeah. mustafa uh this is example i want to buy one se ekor ayam okay so and this means it beri saya dua ekor ayam okay for example let's say i give you you want to buy a tiga a three fish how to say in bahasa melayu three fish tiga uh, yeah. uh, tiga ekor tiga ekor uh, ikan yes tiga ekor ikan okay ismail let's say you want to buy a five crab how to say Hmm. Ah, ke kela bagi tu beri saya ah lima lima what lima iko hmm ah crab what what kitang 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 ah okay you have to know eh the the item. All right, yeah. you want ekor ketam. But if you want to buy a meat, a lamb, or uh, lamb or, or a beef, don't put ekor. Uh, if you say, I want dua ekor uh, beef, okay? This is a not meat, but you got a cow. You got a sheep, okay? Two or sheep. So how can you bring back the sheep? Ah, uh, <laughs> yes. Don't say, don't say, uh, if you want to buy a meat, yeah, a meat, don't meat, say ekor. That means pieces, how many pieces, right? Yes. If you say ekor, that means how many pieces you get. Two of cow, three of cow. So how you can put a cow in your car to bring it back? Huh? If you want to buy a meat, just say a kilo. Okay. Uh, this is animal only. So continue. Biar saya timbang dulu. Okay, let me wait it is. Total is three kilo, madam. Uh, that means is uh, two chicken is three kilo. Baiklah, give me a kilo of shrimp and one kilo of meat. Okay, so how may how much? Okay, uh, a kilo of shrimp or prawn is tiga puluh empat ringgit. A kilo one kilo meat is thirty ringgit. So total is seventy ringgit. Uh, not 70, 90 ringgit, 70 cent only. So this is a money and this is a chain balance. Okay. Thank you. Sama-sama. All right. So I hope you know. So you have to know the vocab here. Okay. If you go into the market. Okay, sorry. Yes, Mustafa. There is a discount before the last, the last two sentences. Yes. Was discount? She has, she's asking about discount. No, no discount, not discount. Okay, the total is 70, uh, 70 ringgit. Uh, not seven, 90 ringgit, seventy cent. Is it? Yeah. And Salma mm -hmm. give ninety one. So this is a balance. Uh -huh. Okay. Change. Uh, okay, okay. Yeah, change. This is a balance. Yeah, okay. All right. Okay, okay. So when you're going to market, of course you need to know the vocab here. Okay. Uh, what a kilogram in Bahasa Melayu, we call it se kilo. Uh, do you remember the last time I told you a se kilo, that means it's one, not satu kilo. We just use se. If you want to count one, two, three, yes, satu, dua, tiga. But if you want to count the money uh, or whatever, you just going to se. 
Okay, sir. Sir Kilo. Okay, Ekor. This is what I'm trying say, to... Sorry. Yes. Can I yes. say Sir Ringgit? Yes, of course. Uh -huh. uh, sir Ringgit. Okay. Uh -huh. And then Ekor. Ekor, uh, what I tried to tell you, collective noun for animal only. All right? Uh, please don't... If you want to buy a two carat, don't say I want two ekor carat. Uh, please. Because carrot is not animal. All right. Timbang. Wait. Please wait. Sila timbang. Sis timbang. Okay. Timbang. Duit is money. Not, not do it eh. Duit. Uh, not do it. Duit. Okay. And this one is baki. Baki that's in balance. Not this kind. Okay. Balance. Sometimes uh, we call it change. Okay. This is a change. Price. Price in Bahasa Melayu we call it harga. How much? Berapa harga? Okay, that's why I asking you. Harga ni, berapakah harganya? How about price? Okay. Berapa? Berapa? If the price, you have to, you should to be how much? Okay. If the thing, you have, uh, you should to be, uh, you, have, you should to use how many? How much and how many? Berapa? Okay, so simple. And now we are going to bookstore. Alright, wait eh, wait eh. Tolong, tolong Umi jap. Jangan duduk kat sini. Perlahankan sikit telefon tu. Umi ada kelas. Tolong, tolong turun bawah. Tolong turun bawah. Wait eh. Okay, now we are going to bookstore, all right? So, let me introduce to you the thing in bookstore, okay? Of course, you know the, the name of the thing, okay, but in your language. But now today, you have to know the name of the thing in Bahasa Melayu because you have to answer it the exam, okay? Uh, so, you go to the uh, bookstore and you want to buy it. What we call it is pembaris, okay? We call it is pembaris. Okay, uh, please remember the name is Pembaris Ruler. And that one is Pemadam. Pemadam refer to, uh, what is it? Eraser. <laughs> yes, eraser. Sometimes forget it. Alright, this one is eraser. Okay, eraser. And that one is highlighter. We call it pen penyerlah. Okay. And penyela. But honestly, I told you, uh, we are Malaysia people still call it is highlighter, not pen penyela. If you come to Malaysia, you want to, uh, uh, you go to the bookstore and want to buy highlighter, please don't ask the staff, uh, where is pen penyela? I'm, I believe the staff it may be, what? Pen penyela? Uh, because we are Malaysia people always call highlighter. Okay, but you have to know the name in Bahasa Melayu to answer your exam. Paper only. Alright. So, this one is Cecair Pemadam. Cecair Pemadam, uh, we call it is uh, uh, liquid paper. Okay, liquid paper. Or sometimes we call it is correction tape. Ah, so, please go, to, and when you go to the bookstore, the same situation. Don't ask him for the stuff at bookstore. What, uh, where I can find the cecair pemadam? For sure. The stuff is... Huh? <laughs> okay, because we are Malaysia people don't call cecair pemadam. Still use uh, liquid paper or correction tape. Alright. So, this one is pencil. Same name in Bahasa English. Pencil too. And this one is a uh, kertas. Uh, same name in Arabic. Uh, uh, right. Kertas. Okay. Uh, kertas, that means it's paper. Okay, plain paper or color paper, we call it kertas. So, uh, Dr. In, in Arabic, we call all of those kertasia. All of kertas. those. So, regarding to, to book things or th like this, uh, all of those. So, not only the paper. Oh, okay. Book, always kertas. Yeah. Oh, yeah. okay, okay. I know something. Mm -hmm. When I go to the Arabic, yes. I, I got a kertas. Yes, yes. Okay. 
Alright, so this one is a buku latihan. I mean, it's exercise book. Buku latihan. And this one is pengasah. Siapa pengasah. Okay, you have to know the pronunciation is pengasah. And this one is kalam. Okay, pen. Pen. Okay, pen. Ah. Okay, so uh, I hope you know the name thing in Bahasa Melayu. Alright, so we are going to the second situation. Okay, this is a second situation where Suraya go to bookstore and she wants to buy a sum of stationery. Okay, let's meet uh, to read it and you have to catch up how about the pronunciation. And sorry when I don't uh, ask your name to read it because we are so rushing. Okay, you can follow uh, how to read it in YouTube after I publish in YouTube. Alright, so let me read first. Suraya, hi, boleh saya tahu di mana saya boleh dapatkan buku latihan, pemadam serta pembaris. Okay, that's mean is hi, may I know where I can get the buku latihan, pemadam and pembaris. What is the name of thing in Bahasa English? What buku latihan? What book latihan? Huh? Notebook? Yes, exercise book. Okay. Exercise I was showing you exercise book. Pemadam. What pemadam? Eraser. Yes, eraser. Pembaris. What pembaris? Hmm? Ruler. Yes, ruler. ruler. So you, you should be to know the name is Suraya Kam and uh, where I can get the exercise book, razor and ruler. Okay. So the staff at the uh, store book say, yeah, sure, you can get the uh, exercise book in front of the uh, shop, in front of the store, and then eraser and ruler at the shop. Okay, at the shop there. Okay. Uh, on the shelf there. Alright. So Suraya go to take the item what she is needed and come back here. Baiklah. Baiklah. Saya hendak membayar kesemuanya. That means it's okay. I want to pay all of this. Okay. How much uh, for each item? Berapakah harga untuk setiap barang ini? Berapakah harga untuk setiap barang ini? That means how much for each item. Okay. And then staff say harga bagi sebuah buku latihan ialah RM2.50. Pemadam berharga RM60. Dan pembari pula harganya RM70. Jumlah kesemuanya ialah RM3.80. That means it's exercise book two ringgit fifty cent, eraser is sixty cent, uh, ruler is seventy cent, and the total is three ringgit ninety cent. Okay, uh, baik lah. Okay, this is a money. This is a balance or this is a change. Thank you, sama sama. Okay, uh, you did it. Everyone, you did it. Everyone, you ready or not? Because I'm worried because I go too so fast. It's okay, it's okay. It's okay, teacher. Okay. Ah, okay. Thank you. Please respond me. All right. So now we are going to the counter. Okay, we are counter to paying bill. Okay. Ah. So I want to tell you sometime. This is a secret actually. Okay. Ah. Uh, um, uh, what is? If I told you, um, <laughs> because I will put this video in YouTube, it's so very dangerous to tell you now. <laughs> Alright, so actually, uh, this is a very familiar question in final exam. Alright, uh, okay. Uh, this is a very familiar, very popular question in exam. Why? Because in exam, maybe, um. The examiner will be put the sample receipt to you and they will asking you, 
how how many uh, someone have to pay for this bill. So you need to read this bill. Okay, you have to know how to read this bill. Okay, so how to read this bill? You have to know about the keyword. Okay, a keyword like this. Okay, this one. You have to know the keyword like this. Maybe the receipt the examiner uh, gives to you don't translation in English like this. Okay. Uh, the receipt is very easy because you have a translation in English. Okay. But in exam, maybe the examiner gives you the sample of receipt. Don't have translation in English. Don't have uh, English translation. So how to uh, how do you know how how much uh, we need to pay? How about overdue? How about uh, receipt number? So you have to know the keyword. Okay. You have to know the keyword is. Outstanding. Okay, that means it's tunggakan. Tunggakan. Okay. And then charge semasa. This means it's charge, eh? Not not just, not cheese. Okay, charge. Charge semasa. That means it's current charge. Same pronunciation, but spelling is different. Current charge. Charge semasa. Okay. Jumlah perlu dibayar. Jumlah perlu dibayar is some payable. Okay, some payable. Ah, how many? How much you need to pay? Alright. And this one is charge bulanan. Monthly charge. Okay, like a, a electricity bill maybe you have a monthly charge. Maybe uh, uh, what? Uh, what? Handphone bill. Okay, bill handphone. You have a monthly charge. Alright. But um. Your school fees not monthly charge. Okay, lump sum. Ah, all right. This one is tax. Tax means is cukai. So, this one is receipt for receipt. Money is duit sum lah. Okay. So now you have you have to know how to read the uh, receipt. So let's me. I asking uh, someone. Question is, uh, soon ruining. Are you here? Soon ruining. Oh, are you here already? Okay, okay, you turn in. Uh, never mind. I call it the another, uh, another people because you have already answering me in the last time. Jan Manru, Jan Manru. Yes, yes, I'm here. Okay, Jan Manru, please tell me how many uh charge we need to pay based on this receipt. Mm. Um. Uh, uh, no, 92 ringgit. Okay, you have to, because have a note, okay. 92 ringgit, 45 sen. Okay. okay. Uh, I thought uh, final exam may be easy because you don't to pronounce, you just to write. Uh, right? Milan puluh dua ringgit empat puluh lima sen. Okay. Milan puluh dua ringgit empat puluh lima sen. Okay. Um, how Hong Xia? How Hong Xia? Yes, teacher, I'm here. Okay. Please tell me the payment due date. Ah, uh, you have to pay this receipt before the due date. What the due date? Please tell me what the how to read the number in Bahasa this is a thousand Dua ribu. Uh, 
I'm sorry. I don't know how to say it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, everyone. Okay, everyone. I told you, please remember the number in Bahasa Melayu. Okay? And how to read the number. Uh, because I don't know uh, your task two. Okay? Your test two. You uh, have a need to write it or just uh, for reading. Okay? Uh, please remember. 2019. Okay, I want to tell you, please, uh, attention. In Malaysia, we use uh, the first number come from a day. Okay, day. Because the Europe style, this is a month and then day and then year. Is it? But Malaysia, day, month, year. Uh, please don't tell me that some of you maybe say, uh, this is a second uh, September. 2nd September 2019. This is not 2nd September. This is a 9 February 2019. Ah, please, you have to know. Okay, so I hope every, uh, uh, everyone know how to read the receipt is. Okay. Ah. So we are going to the last situation is. Last situation, we have a 5 minute anymore. Alright, the situation is Mahmoud going to the counter. He want to pay a electricity bill. Okay, Mahmoud going to counter. He want to pay electricity bill. Okay, Mahmoud say, Good morning. Okay, good morning. Boleh saya buat bayaran bill electric saya di sini? Okay. Good morning. Boleh saya buat bayaran bill electric saya di sini? That means if, uh, can I pay uh, my bill here? Uh, and then staff in the counter say, good morning, sir. Of, uh, for sure. Okay, you can pay your bill here. Okay. Uh, if you know, this is a situation, very similar situation in, in Malaysia. We are going to the sum part. Even you know that you can pay here, but you must to look, uh, be nice. Okay. You have to ask him, some other uh, somebody. Can I pay bill here? Because even you know, this is part to paying bill. Okay? You have to look very nice. This is a Malaysia uh, attitude. Alright? Yeah, uh, and then, uh, ini bill electric saya. This is my bill. Berapakah charge semasa yang perlu saya bayar? How many I? I need to pay. Any, uh, any what, what we call it? Tunggakan. Any current charge or not? Okay, any current charge or not? Okay, and then pegawai counter kata, yes, you have a current charge, sir. This is a seven C ringgit. Ada tunggakan pada bill intake sebanyak tujuh puluh dua ringgit. Charge bulanan bill berjum berjumlah tujuh puluh ringgit. Monthly, monthly bill is seven C ringgit thirty five cent. So. Jadi jumlah yang perlu dibayar oleh intik ialah sebanyak RM142.35 sahaja. So you need to pay RM142.35 only. Baiklah. Okay. This is a money. Ini duitnya. This is a receipt. This is, ini receipt-nya. Terima kasih. Sama-sama. Okay. You read it? Huh? Yes. Ah, okay. I hope you did it because this is a last slide for today. Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. So before okay. I end my class, let me show your uh, exercise. Okay. This is your exercise five. Okay. So exercise one, exercise two, and exercise three uh, already submitted. Okay. So after this, please. Please don't ask me, teacher, uh, what the due date, what the deadline. I have to submit exercise 5. Okay, I told you the exercise 5, we don't have a mark. We don't have a deadline. We don't have a what, 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 what. Okay, so after this class, you have to uh, do your exercise because exercise uh, help you to answering uh, exams. Okay, exam paper, final exam. 
Ah, uh, so you have to answer it because the question in final exam looks like very similar in your exercise. Ah, uh, we just change a few of words only. So you have to complete your exercise. Okay, the question number one, you have to match the word below correctly. Okay, I thought this is very easy. You can close your eye and then mesh, 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 mesh. All right? Because it's so very easy. Beli. I just told you. Beli. What we call it in Bahasa Inggeris. Bayar. Berat. Tunggakan. Baki. Just mesh. All right? The second question is very dangerous. Ah, Why I, I use the word dangerous? Because the second question is similar in final exam. I don't know. Final exam or test two. Okay? I'm not sure. Because I'm not. I'm not uh, making your uh, paper exam, but I just know from the examiner. Examiner told me the question like that, blah, 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 blah. All right. So the second one question, you have to rearrange the sentence below into a complete story. Okay. That means you have to know uh, what's, what the, uh, what are the one, uh, the beginning. This is a beginning. This is a supper. This is the ending. This is intermediate. This is what? Which one the number one? You have to rearrange and then please uh, copyright uh, in the sentence. All right? Just copyright in the sentence only. All right. So the last part, okay, the last, uh, maybe it's a quick difficult. Even difficult, you have to try. Okay? Uh, you have to try to make it an easy word. Don't, don't make a summary, please. Okay? Just a few words only. Ten, five word is only. All right. Please use the word I provide to you only. All right. So how to write down? Okay. You have to make a simple sentence based on the picture. The first picture is uh, in a post office. Post office, right? It's not in mall. Post office. So you have to write down maybe uh, Mustafa pergi ke pejabat post. That means it's Mustafa going to post office. Simple sentence only. Just a few words only. Don't write the summary. Don't write the essay. Please. All right. Don't make a paragraph. Just a sentence. Same the B. B in the wet market. What I was told you. What I was teach you before. Please use. Berapakah harga sekilo ikan? Okay. Even a dialog is okay. Harganya RM5 sekilo. It's okay. Okay. Boleh saya beli tiga ekor ikan? Ah, So you have make a sentence based on this situation. That, that may be a vegetable because uh, looks like a watermelon. Uh, what they call it looks like a watermelon. I don't know. So and the, th the last one picture is a bookstore. Okay. How to pay it. Okay. Or you want to ask the staff. Where you can get the sum of book. Okay, I don't know. You have to write down the sentence. Alright, so class. Uh, we have to finish our class early. And sorry. Uh, again. Because I have a short notice. We got a meeting for 3 p.m. So I have to attend it. Alright, so before that. Any question? Are there so I have one. Thank you. Okay, uh, Musafa, do you have a question? Someone have a question? Yeah, 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 me. Yang, yes. Yang Hai Yang. Okay, yeah. Yang Hai Yang, so yeah? You, yeah, 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 you just said uh, we submit the, the exercise one, two, three, right? Okay, exercise, where to submit is exercise one, one, two, and three is uh, finished already enough because uh, we have uh, already sit down for test one. So now oh, we, yeah, yeah, yeah. so now you focus for exercise four and exercise uh, the next, all right? Uh, to oh, focus yeah, yeah, because you, so you, you can, said we submit this, so uh, yes. I just uh, You can submit in Edmodo. You have to click the button message and please send private to me. Don't put in the status Edmodo. If you put in the status Edmodo, everyone can see your answer. Okay? You know how to okay, submit okay, to okay. me? Okay. Yes, click the uh, message, uh, button message in Edmodo. And one more oh, thing. Yeah, yeah. One more thing. I have 200, uh, 200 and more students okay, in this subject. So if I uh, little bit late to remark your exercise, uh, sorry, give me some
uh, some more time, I will check it later. Okay. If so long time you waiting, please remind me. Maybe your uh, message is going to. I need to scroll down. Okay. So we have to ha we have to submit it all. Yes, you can submit in Edmodo. Okay. If you do want, uh, if you do want to submit, it's okay. Okay, because exercise so, don't have a mark. If do you want to su submit, I give you the schema. You will be checked with your own. Mm -hmm. Right. Uh, so do we need to submit the exercise run? Uh, it's up to you. Five. Okay. Yes. In Edmodo. Yes, yes. Oh, oh. Okay. Okay. Uh, it's up to you. Want to submit or not? Okay. If you want to submit once, uh, give me to check it. I will check it. If you don't want to submit, I give you the schema. You have to check, uh, check with your own based on the schema. All right. Okay. Okay. So, any question again? Then have. No. All right, so if you have a question again after this, uh, please drop your question in uh, WhatsApp group. If I don't have a class, I will reply. If I have a class, maybe your uh, classmate will be replied to help you. Okay, so before we end our class today, I would like to remind you the two things. The first thing is please complete your assignment one before 20 December. If you submit late, if you submit after 20 December, no mark to provide to you because this is an in system. You have to turn in in at modo. Okay, don't submit for email or for something for me. You have to turn in at modo with your partner. Please find your partner. And then the second one, uh, next week we don't have a class. You have a honeymoon time for one week. Okay, we will uh, meet after uh, 14, 14 December. So please don't forget what I will teach you. Please memorize the number. Please uh, remember the words in Bahasa Melayu. Okay? So uh, I need to attend my meeting. So I hope uh, I will miss you for one week. And see you. Jumpa lagi. Assalamualaikum. Goodbye. Jumpa lagi. Yes, jumpa lagi. Jumpa lagi. Yes, yes. Okay, Assalamualaikum.